carpet look. We can all grown up. Nicole, we haven't seen her in this kind of look before. Uh, you know, I don't think I have. Although she does, she did her long gown to the London premiere. She does often go forward. Yeah, I don't think I've seen such severe, uh, heavy eye makeup and the hair slicked back. She looks like a she looks grown. She's like a lady. You know, I see a Victoria Beckham look going on here. Yeah, oh, her. she definitely has. She's, she's looking fierce tonight. Yeah. As I say, she's giving them face. That's what she called that look. Giving them face. Bottega Veneta, Giuseppe Shinodi shoes, and Lorraine Swartz jewelry. That's right, Emma Watson's all grown up, guys. She went help couture all the way for this carpet. I love, I love that she doesn't play it safe. It's interesting. She's like the main girl surrounded by all these gentlemen, so she already stands out at, as is, wouldn't you say? Absolutely, and if you look, I don't know if you can see the detailing yet, the fans at home, but she actually has like gold um, crystals on the side of her eyes, so she's not playing it safe at all. Waiting for besides Daniel, of course, everyone wanted to see what Emma was wearing. Exactly. confident that there's basically nothing they can throw at me that will be too alarming so it's good okay thank you we're just gonna, gonna bring her back guys uh, she's gonna do a photo call on the red carpet but don't worry everyone she's coming back I'm gonna do a little posy pose with uh, Daniel Radcliffe and some of the other cast members uh, the money shot Edson hi oh, Emma how are you Loving it. So why did you pick this? You look you look very exotic tonight. I like it. Thank you. Um, I guess I just thought it was suitably dramatic, I guess. Um, and just interesting and different. And I don't know. I just kind of loved it. So we covered the London premiere. You were crying. Do you feel the same emotions tonight that you felt then? Yeah, in a way, this one's more emotional than for me because it's, def it's this is the last one. This is like, this is the end of the press tour for me. So this really is kind of closing, closing the chapter. So yeah, it's definitely emotional. What's the next chapter in your life? Obviously, you went to college for a bit. You've tried other things. What's next for you? Um, gosh. So, uh, here at London, uh, the, sorry, the New York premiere now, and uh, really excited to be here, and, and just very excited about this movie, and really hope you guys like it. Thanks. So there you have it, Emma Watson, who says that, you know, she's going to get on with her life after Potter, which is not an easy thing to do when you've been doing something for 10 years years and it's been such a part of your life so obviously wish Emma the best